to be totally just in touch with nature and have nothing else interfering with your experience. Do you get like an extreme moment of clarity when you rock climb? You have to step outside your comfort zone and push yourself to levels that you didn't know. Oh. The Outing Club is just a club that gives people an opportunity to get off campus and get into nature, into the outdoors, doing a variety of activities from canoeing to rock climbing to hiking. I came to UConn and it's you know, a campus of 20 something thousand, I didn't know anybody and I really wanted to meet people to do stuff with on the weekends. I have been involved in the outdoors for a long time and it's just always something that I've enjoyed and I felt that when I came to UConn, joining the Outing Club would be a good way to connect with people that like to do the same kind of things as I like to do. So we're going to set this rope up, somebody's going to belay me from the bottom uh, and I'm going to climb up uh, the other end of the rope up to the top of this and then I'm going to rappel down. I'm flaking out the rope right now and uh, Eric's going to lead climb, which is uh, when you climb up and place your own protection. It's a little bit more dangerous but it's definitely um, a lot more exciting. Rock climbing is really a mental sport. You have to get over your fear of heights. You have to be used to being on the side of a cliff only tied into a rope. Life gets really stressful in college. It's a great way to relieve stress. In that moment, that's like all you're thinking about. You don't have to worry about anything else. You're taking your life in your hands and it's a big responsibility, but it's also a real thrill when you know that you have the skill and the ability to do something like that. The outing club is fun, it's adventurous, and it's challenging. You can have a great day out in the nice sun, and even if it's a miserable day, a lot of times afterwards you'll, you'll have a connection with those people. It's really a, a special thing.